Hello, let's look at an Oracle Analytics feature to persist right-click advanced calculation in order to reuse them in different visualizations. So let us first create a scatter plot of sales and gross unit price by stores, so by city. So this is going to plot all of our stores and on gross unit price as X and sales as Y. And let ask o, Oracle Analytics to define clusters automatically. So this is defining five clusters here using k-means algorithm. So this is an interesting insight and it visually makes sense. I can see all the different clusters are being spread over my different stores. But now I'm interested in reusing these clusters to measure other metrics beyond unit price and sales. And that's exactly what this feature is about. So notice first that there are no calculations in my workbook. And if I right click on the clusters object, I can see an option here that is add to my calculation. So when I click this, the calculation of the cluster appears in my custom calculation. I can edit it and visualize the details. There is even a comment telling me when and how this was created. And that object can now be used in different visualizations. So let me create a sales bar chart by these clusters. So now I can see for each of these clusters, let me put this in color, the sales amount. This cluster number four, which is a brown one, is actually the one that pulls the highest sales. The blue one, which is highest gross unit price, is low in sales. And the number five here, the green one, which is stores with high sales, actually aggregates to only a medium total of sales. The interesting part is that I can use these clusters based on sales and gross unit price to analyze a completely different metric, such as profit, which we're seeing here, which shows an interesting distribution of profit between these clusters. I can build any custom calculation and still use the same clusters that we defined to split and distribute this uh, discount ratio in this case. So I can see a very contrasted uh, uh, discount ratio value by these different clusters. So the blue ones have a high discount ratio, although they have the highest unit price and so on. So that's very interesting business insight using this right click. This feature also works for outliers. So I'm doing a right click outliers here on my scatter plot. And here again, I can persist that calculation by adding it to my calculation. And I can just drag it into any chart now, just as a dimension. So I can even drag it in the chart that has already the cluster. So now we see a visualization that combines both the cluster that we had previously defined, along with the fact that each store is an outlier or not. So that's a combination of pretty advanced insights that I was able to define in just a few right clicks. Now, obviously this works with any aggregation, so we can drag that same combination on the discount ratio, which is a custom calculation, and then I can see which of these individuals stick out. Thank you for watching that video.